Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to RimWorld! People have said that the difficulty I chose was basically way too easy to start over and start on rough. So that's what I did, did the basic building stuff, we'll go over my character real quick and then we'll just continue playing as normal. So our character now is NG, she is a female colonist of the age of 27. Uh, she is good at, she likes shooting, not very good at melee, social, animals, she could give or take, medicine, this is her stat, she loves construction. Very passionate about mining, even though she's bad at it, and she's really good at crafting, at least at this level, which is great. Um, she has a couple of quirks that I don't know if I can show. There they are. Actually, they're right over here. So she is a foundry apprentice uh, when she was a kid, or which gives her plus one melee, plus three construction, plus three crafting, but she's not very artistic. She's a combat engineer. She has high shooting, construction, and crafting, which is actually just all great. That's awesome. She's a prostophile. Uh, and she feels limited in her feeble human body. She often dreams of going bionic. Maybe we can do something about that later. She's a careful shooter, which gives her better aim, accuracy, and uh, shooting. And she's greedy. She, uh, she needs a really impressive bedroom. She gets, in, uh, she gets a mood loss. She doesn't get what she wants. So I'm curious, actually, if we take a look at her needs right now. Lacks bionic body part. Can't do anything about that. No impressive bedroom. Don't know what to tell you about that. She's currently in the darkness right now. Also not a big deal. So we're just kind of getting the, the usual stuff built up that we haven't gotten built in a while. Uh, we have a couple sleeping spots that I should probably get rid of. Let's get rid of that. I don't know why he's not sleeping. Oh, this is our dog, by the way, Kona. I don't know why he's not sleeping in his bed. It's really weird. Um, but there's nothing I can really do about it. I also don't know how to feed my dog without kibble. Remember, the since this is a new game, uh, the, tr the traders have not come. We also have some gross-ass boomalopes kind of just chilling. And morning has come. We've got some power being stored and all kinds of good stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and go into our zones and make a growing zone, which we have not done. Why don't we do a 5x5 five five growing zone right outside just to get some stuff going. And hopefully Angie wakes up soon. There we go. Let's get her get her day on, on the way here. We'll get, oh, actually gonna order her to start hauling and shit as well soon. But I'm gonna want to drop a door here. And then I want to build this as like a kitcheny area. Where in the god's name is the wall? There it is. Uh, what we'll end up doing is something like this. Boom. Beautiful. I think we can build on top of these lines and it shouldn't be a big deal power-wise. Keep an eye on it to make sure that's the case. Seems to be... Yep, it's still getting power. She can go ahead and plant. Are we out of... Uh, are we out of wood? We may very well be. Why don't we drop this... Here. And then for power, we drop, we draw some lines up here, and that should do it. Hello, what the hell? A gatherer from the Vassalau of the Mesa, Mesa is visiting the colony. His name is Orange Orange Abruño. What's up, man? How you doing? Hey, is everything good? Add Bill. Oh, we can make kibble. Do X times, then we'll butcher creature. Do until you have. Has multiple unpredictable products? Yeah, we'll just do that for now. Why don't we hunt then? Let's um get some hunting going. She has a, she has a good shot, so there it is. I don't know what you want me to do. Why don't we drop a zone in here as well? You're just gonna eat. Uh, let's zone. A very small stockpile, three by three. It will only be foods. Corpses as well, but not human corpses, only animal corpses. And all foods. Okay. So why don't we go dismiss, butcher creatures, do until, do forever. So always butcher creatures. Make kibble. So I don't know if you can just make kibble? Is she just feeding him? What is she doing? Training. She's training. Co oh, she has food. Oh, that's how you train. Give them food. 
Mathis understands now. Mathis gets it. All right, see you later. Thanks for visiting my weird colony. Hopefully you weren't scoping me out for something bizarre at some point. Yo, man, you can come and sleep in my my room. Okay, you just moved. I don't. Maybe it's just because it needs. She needs to be trained. It's very possible. Uh, let's go ahead and drop some more orders for hunting then. Actually, no. Let's let her finish this. Do we not have any more metals? We may be out of metals. So let's go ahead and order some mining to happen instead. Do I have metals nearby? I have something over here. Oh, there's a building there. I didn't even notice that before. Are you serious? Like the next closest metals? I guess we only have whatever this is. I'll give the order and see what happens. I don't know what it is. Also, I decided to build my colony right here because there's a very easily wallable area here. So we can kind of use that to our advantage, hopefully. Uh, defensively, anyway. Ancient danger. As Angie draws near the ancient wall, a sense of foreboding overcomes her. She isn't sure why, but she feels that this dusty structure may contain great danger. Great. Awesome. Super happy about that. Do not, whatever you do, open that shit. So whatever's in here is a problem. I built my colony, like, directly next to this. That's solid, Mathis. Real good. This is what? Silver? So this is just money. All of that is just fucking silver. Um, hmm. I should just click on it. Yeah, compact steel. Let's go ahead over there and start mining out that little area. Here, you just finish this up. I'll let you finish it, it's fine. It's a lot of silver. Okay, we're gonna cancel the other two. Just go get, I need the metal, is what I need. It's a hell of a walk, unfortunately, but it is what it is. We'll make do. We have to. We'll get some research going at some point. Yeah, calling us automatically. Uh, yeah, I already knew that. I know I need defenses. That's why I'm mining out metal, man. Doing what I need to provide defenses for myself. This is as fast as she can mine. She's by herself, so I don't know what else you want from me. What are you doing? Are you just gonna build? Okay, good, you're building. And you're gonna eat. That's fine, too. Oh, where'd you go? Well, okay, where are you going? I think you're just grabbing stuff as necessary and building that and building that way. All right, there we go. So once this is done being built, we can turn the power right off. Turn that off. Okay, see you later. Just trying to save some power. We want to hunt. Is that something worth hunting? A rat? We'll drop the hunt on it. Ooh, actually, you know what? Get rid of that as well. Just start stack, uh, storing up some food. Now, can this go bad? Hair leather? I don't think so. Well, once, this, once he's trained, I think we're gonna be in good shape. Like, he can join us on hunts, and I'm hoping, anyway. One. Chow down. You put it in the food hopper? Really? You have kibble. Make it until you have five for now. She's got a bench. She's got a shot on her. I'll give her that. How do I make kibble? Like, no idea. No idea what I'm doing incorrectly. Hopefully, it's working. All right, you're going to finish mining. I'll let you do that. We need it. Oh, what the fuck? Wanderer joins. A villager named Orion has arrived and is joining the colony. She is a tactician. Yo, where? What? Where'd you come from? Uh, Sun Village, uh, Glitterville. Welcome to Glitterville. I'm very confused. All right, 
Haley Orion. Uh, test subject. So you were a test subject. So you got high shooting, but your fire firefighting, doctoring, and wander wardening is disabled on you. You're a good shot. You're slow poke. You're bloodlust. Orion gets a rush from hurting people and never minds the sight of blood of, or death. She is twice as likely to start a social fight. Great. Night Owl likes to work at night. She gets a mood bonus if awake at night and mood loss if she's awake during the day. She's okay. So we can have like 24 hour like rotations here, I guess. All right. Well, we need to build another bed now. So let's get another one. All right, Orion. Welcome, I guess. You're just kind of organizing already. Hand tailoring bench, sculptor's table. This is for clothing. Simple research bench might be better for us at this point. All right, let's get some hauling going. We need to start cleaning up the area in here. It's real bad. And then we'll cut down these two plants. So there's your bed, Orion. Kind of chatting with us, I guess. There you go. That's what I like to see. We're going to start actually, like, setting up proper orders now because we have two people. But for now, I think everybody can still do a little bit of everything. I don't know where you're going. You are just hauling. Okay, that's fine. Let's give some light. Shall we? Into these rooms so people aren't bitching about darkness. For as long as we have metals, we can produce all of it. So it's fine with me. Yeah, keep mining. There we go. All right, so that's that. I would like to continue building production stuff. I don't know what this is going to do for me of an electric tailoring bench. So there's a tailoring bench and an electric tailoring bench, but I mean, we might just want to do tailoring, get her some clothing. So let's get a tailoring bench up and running. Maybe a simple research bench might not be a bad thing either. Now how, like, let's take a look at, like, what, do you, do you hate living, sleeping with somebody? Needs. Shared a bedroom. Naked, shared a bedroom, disturbed sleep, feeling terrible. So you guys need separate rooms, unfortunately. That's fine. We can do that. We can probably drop another room right here. If necessary. I could maybe even draw a wall right down, but I feel like that might be bad. I mean, if I did a wall here, and then did a door here, I'm assuming you'll be pissed that the room is small. So I'm not going to. And we'll get your bed over there in a bit. Basically the tailoring bench, I need to get I just need to get you some clothing. And we can order you to hunt at least a bit too for some useful stuff. You can start building your own room. What is this? Megatherium. Male Megatherium. You know what? Uh for you, let's not let you do that. You're a worker. No, you know what? You're anything. How do I set up stuff? Orders. I can't have you hunting. One well, God's name, how do I stop you from doing that? World, factions, animals. Okay. There it is. Okay. Uh, you can't hunt. Sorry. No, you gotta stop. Okay, there you go. It's gotta stop you from hunting. You're not allowed to hunt. You are. Because that thing is gigantic. And it looks freaking awesome. Look at that thing. That's so much food. Alright, what we need to do is make a uh, pants and a shirt t-shirt so please whoever can make stuff feel free 
I don't know if you can. I don't know how that works. But I need you to do it. Get rid of these. Like, can it show me how what I need? Details. It just literally is allowed to use anything. Okay. Well. It's fine. We're gonna get some wood chopped down because we have none, so we can't finish our buildings. I don't know where you're going. Just hauling things, I think. Oh, okay, we're working on the simple bench over here. So these boom things are gonna scare me. Because if they explode anywhere near me, I'm fucked. But that's okay, I guess. Raid. Group of pirates from the landmines have arrived nearby. They'll prepare for a while. Harley. That's a new noise, first of all. That's a little spooky either way. I'm gonna wait. Until we see them moving in. Okay, he's beginning their assault. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is, uh... Recruit you. Turn that on, recruit you, and put you right here. That was easy. Alright. I don't know if I want to capture this fool, or what. We might want to. Let's take a look at him real quick. Teenage female drifted from the landmines, age 17. Apocalypse survivor. Factory worker. Yeah, we might want to do that. So what we can do is build another bed. Right here and make it a prisoner bed. If we can get that built. I mean, if she dies beforehand, she dies beforehand. I'm going to try and capture her, however. Let's see if we can make that work. So we want to do for prisoners. Capture. Hup. Ah. Here we go. We're bandaging her up. So right now she's got a gunshot all over her play all over the place. She could end up dying in anyway. We'll see. We're trying real bad. Look at the bandaging. Poor results. And finally she's she's gonna she's bandaged up. We'll see what can, she can do. She can't really do much. She's unconscious, really. Um, Friendly chat. Chat and recruit is what we want. They can get... I guess they can get, like, regular medicine. Could execute them if we need to. And that reminds me, we need to be... We need to another zone, another grow zone. It's been a while. Um, I forgot that we need to do another grow zone can't actually grow there. I don't think I can grow over here either. No. Delete that. I want to basically get a, uh, there we go. I think it's called Zerium. Unless that's not allowed to be grown anymore. Heal root. None of your non-downed growers have this skill, so the plant will not be sown. Oh, shit. Strawberry plant? Okay, can't do that either. I'm assuming if it shows it, I can't do it. Alright, we'll just do that for now, then. Just plant up and get them, get them growing here. We'll give her medicine, regardless, and hope for the best. How you doing, pupper? You're fine on food. So you must be eating. Like, we must be feeding you without realizing it. Solar generator's been broken down. It's getting fixed, though. Thank you. Appreciate that. Visitors. A group from the Vizal Mesa. Harley's still kind of out right now. We'll see what we do. We're force-feeding her. That's fine. Disease. Harley has grown sick from infection. The infection is in her left arm. 
All right. Well, if we want... Let's give her some good meds. On edge. Well, no shit. We'll see what we can do. We can have you trade with them, see what they have. Meat, venison, components we might want. No, wait, they don't have that. What do they have? Orange. Hey, orange is back. It's the orange guy. They have venison and our uranium spear. Not particularly useful. Not right now, anyway. A group from Cowboy's Village are visiting. Okay, I'm ready for that as well. Maybe they have something I can trade for. Hopefully they don't end up fighting one another here. Um, if we can get some clothing, I guess? Beer, a triple rocket launcher, PDW. I have how much? We could buy a gun. Basically, I want Orion to have that. Equip it. There we go. Cleaning up is fine. Um, she is going in here to clean up the room. Huh. You guys are hopefully eating your own, my, not my food, but your own food. And we're already at 20 minutes. Okay, gotta stop the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, come back next time for some more Rim World and consider dropping a like. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.